Hi, the goal of this video is to give the user an introduction in how to use the controls in Orchestrate. And what I mean by controls is how the user is going to manipulate the models and what a lot of these buttons on the screen are going to do for us. The first thing I want to emphasize is how important it is to actually have a mouse. Orchestrate was designed to allow the user to work up an entire case using literally just the mouse. So it's absolutely critical that you have a mouse in order to really uh, utilize Orchestrate and its controls. So the first thing we're going to do is show you how to rotate the model. All the user needs to do is right click and hold and that will allow you to rotate the model look at the, the teeth from different directions or um, perspectives. To zoom in, use the mouse wheel. And to zoom out, you also use the mouse wheel. To bodily move the model, you simply right click hold, left click hold, and that will allow you to move the model across the screen like this. <clears throat> now, if you happen to get disorientated and move the model off the screen, you don't know where it is, simply click on this little camera up here and that will snap the model right back to the middle of the screen. Okay, to visualize the, the teeth, simply click on upper and that will turn off or turn on the upper model. Same thing with the lower, click on the box and that will turn on and off. We have some preset views up here. So if I click on this here, that will snap the model to the front view, rear view, side views, and we also have the top and bottom views of the model. Over here on the left hand side are the tooth movement controls and we will get into the specifics of the tooth movement controls in the next video. Over here on the right hand side, this is the tooth movement table. Each section corresponds to a tooth. If you'd like, you can go in and type in the particular tooth number. Just don't think it's worth the time to do that. Each one of these columns here represents a, the direction the tooth is moving or has moved. This is for facial lingual, mesial distal, intrusion, extrusion, rotations, torque, and tipping. Okay, so that is the end of this video.